My mother Maria married my father Steve Molina in 1962. It was a wonderful time in her life. My mom loved to dance. Here's my little sister Stephanie with my mom. She was my mother's little jewel. My mother and grandmother Amelia Molina spent lots of time together. My grandmother loved my mom so much. They had so much fun. Here's me Giovanni and my little sister Stephanie, and my older sister Claudia. We had so much fun with my mom. She always gave us so much love. My mother liked to go to the beach. I remember going to the beach all the time growing up. My mother was born in Bogota, Colombia in May 9th of 1946. Her parents, Alberto and Beatriz Duarte, owned a ranch in Girardo, which is in Bogota, Colombia. Here we are with all her nine siblings having lunch. She was so beautiful. I thank God for giving her to us as a mother. My mother married Bill Weeks in 1986. This is Jose Duarte, her brother, walking her down the aisle. Since my grandfather Alberto Duarte passed away, me and my sisters and all our family and friends were there. She was so happy. Bill was a good and godly man. And my mom looked so beautiful. It was a really nice wedding. Here she is at her dinner party. She was always smiling. She looked like an angel. Bill couldn't keep her eyes off of her. They had a beautiful wedding cake and we took so many pictures that day. My mom's spirit was so gentle, and at the same time, she always made everyone laugh with her. I guess that's why Bill fell in love with her. I remember her wedding like it was yesterday. The best part was we were able to get together with our family and friends together and be there to support my mom in this glorious day of her life. Then came my big day, and my mom was escorted by my best man and best friend, Michael Grosso. I married my beautiful wife, Michelle, but what a son never forgets 
is that his precious mother was there to give him a kiss and a hug. I love you, Mom. Okay, you're on tape. I want to know, I want to, I want you to tell me how you feel about today, your son's wedding, how everything was. I feel great. It's a blessing, and I thank God for them, and I really wish them the best. What also so special about my mother was, she was like a child inside, always having fun with us, especially that day at Universal Studios with my grandmother Beatrice and my sister Stephanie, Michelle and Bill and Christina, my niece. What a cutie, and she still is. How many children can say that your mother was your best friend? But she was to all of us. My mom was like a little practical joker. She always played tricks with us. <laughs> I remember all the time. My mother loved her mom, Beatrice, so much. They were always together. What's great about my mother was she really enjoyed her life. I can't remember ever seeing her down. All right, and here's Claudia, pregnant. Let's see it. And I'm tired. I'm tired. Tired, yeah. Tomorrow we'll get everybody. But anyway, this is just a little gathering here. Bill, Tony. Hello. <laughs> You're incognito. She loved her grandchildren so much. Here's Elijah with his Nana. If possible, my mom never missed her grandchildren's birthday. Today was Christina's birthday, and my mom made sure she gave her all the love and attention she deserved. We had so much fun that day. We danced the chicken dance. Little Gabriella was just starting to walk. My mom fell in love with her at the start. She loved her Nana, and her Nana loved her. And her second oldest grandchild, Nicholas, my son. He got his groove in too. <laughs> And yes, I'm the one with the white t-shirt. It was a 50 themes party. These memories of my mom will never be forgotten in our hearts. She touched everyone. If I can go back through time, I would do whatever I could to spend one more second with my mom. We take our loved ones for granted, but we need to realize they aren't going to be here forever. Here's my other son, Matthew Molina, getting to know his Nana.
Sometimes we take these simple things for granted, but these are the memories that live forever in our hearts. Someday we'll realize that the most important part of our lives on earth are the times that we enjoy the company of our family and friends. And for me, is seeing my mother having fun with all of us. There's no price for that in my book. Look at that. Lord, help the children. We had a great time together in Disney World. My mom was a hugger and a kisser, but we loved that about her. Here's my mom with my sister Stephanie and Bill. Yeah, we're having fun here. In this <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Mari Peña. Hello, everybody. I'm having a great time here in Christina's birthday. She's five years old. And here are the clowns, and we're going to have all this thing in here. It's a lot of fun. I said hello to my granddaughter, and the best happiness that God would bless her. And her nieces were so special to her. She was years. a bright light right. in the dark world. It was Chance's birthday, my youngest son, and his Nana was there to celebrate his big day. My mom, so much love, how special she was and how caring she was to all of us. We will miss her in our hearts forever. Then came Gabriella's dedication with my sister Claudia and Tony, her husband, and my dad Steve, and my grandmother, and little Christina, she was there. My mother, how she loved her family. I think it's the only second Gabriella I've ever met. Here's Gabriella from Mark LeMail, Gabriella Carreras, and this is very nice. Fabulous. Johnny, won't you go ahead and take the mic and pray for your wife and pray for your two daughters here? Absolutely. Lord Jesus, I'd like to thank you, Lord, for bringing this girl to our family. And even though it's been nine years in difference, I know she's here to serve a purpose to serve you, Lord. All the days of her life. Little Matt. <laughs> then came Thanksgiving. My mom was so funny that day. Look at that, look at that. 
And here's my mom with Anna, her niece, who went to Metro Zoo that day, and her little grandson, Chance. Here's my mother with Elijah, her grandson, and Annette, her sister. Moments in time never to be forgotten. A beautiful life to a beautiful mother and best friend to everyone. She will live in our hearts forever and ever. Thank you, Jesus, for bringing her to us. See me now. 
Now 